Hey guys, Joe Sweeney with Common Swag Bow Fishing, and today I want to tell you about a product that we hooked up with. This is the Power Max Power Converter, and what this does is run your trolling motor batteries and keeps them at full charge all night long. And if you're a guide, if you're a tournament fisherman, this is key because you can fish all night, all the way up into the morning with full power. And uh, it's been a great addition to our boat, and I uh, just got one of the new units in. We're going to do a quick install video for you, and uh, hopefully this will help you out. And it's pretty simple. I mean, don't overthink it. But the main thing with this, this whole unit is keeping it dry. And as you can see behind me, we're privileged enough to have a center console boat so we don't have to necessarily have a converter box um, or anything like that to keep it dry. But we can stick it underneath the center console and do it that way. So that's how we're going to do it today. And let's go ahead and get started. All right, first part of the install is putting the converter in the area where you wanted to do the install at. Um, the converter box will actually be on the inside of the center console, but we're putting it on the outside, going ahead and pre-marking our holes. Um, from the old converter that I had on here, you can tell it was a little bit bigger, so it works out good. Now, we got, now we're going to have to go in and drill new holes anyway. So um, go ahead and take your pencil, mark your spots where you need to drill on top and bottom. All right, then just pull it off, get your drill out, and go ahead and drill your holes out. All right, now we've got the holes drilled. The only thing that's left to do is take the unit, put it on the inside of the console, and use our stainless, uh, stainless nuts and bolts here, and uh, hook it up. All right, before we actually start the install itself, um, one thing that's, that I do, uh, just for simplicity reasons, I go ahead and mount my, my wire that runs from the converter to the batteries, uh, just simply because it's a lot easier to work with it out here than it is while it's mounted. And one other thing that I stress to you, because this thing is putting out a lot of juice. So what I recommend and um, what PowerMax recommends is a four gauge wire or bigger, depending on how far you're going from the converter box to your batteries, which mine's only about two feet, so I can get away with using a four gauge wire. I would say if you go anything further than four to six feet, maybe even go down to a two gauge. But uh, for, this, for this application, four gauge is plenty. We'll go ahead and mount this up here, but make sure on your converter box, it does have a positive and a negative. Make sure you do not cross them up. And all you need to do this is screwdriver. Just back these, these set screws all the way out. <clears throat> all right, put on the negative first. Sure they slide all the way in the hole. All right. And all you're going to do while you have it pressed in is tighten everything back down really good and tight because this is not something that you want to repair while it's mounted. So just go ahead and make sure you do it right the first time. Second thing, let's put the positive in. Make sure it's pushed all the way in really good. And just take Tighten it down as well. Alright, that should be good. Now this unit here is a 24 volt unit. They also have 12 volt units as well. Um, it's just all in what you use on your boat. As far as for, for us, we use a 24 volt mid cutter riptide. And this right here is plenty enough power to push that thing all night long and it never really bog itself down. So now that we've got our our um, main cables that's going to our batteries installed. We'll go ahead and install everything underneath the console, hook everything up to the batteries, and then we're gonna give it a test run. That's not going anywhere. 
good deal. Well, we got the unit installed. Um, one thing I do have is these little black garments here. I'm gonna stick these in the holes here to make sure no water or anything gets inside the center console. And um, the only other thing I guess we got left to do is hook it up to the battery. All right, put the positive lead on first. Make sure you get it really good and tight. Slide this over here out of the way. Tighten her down the rest of the way. That should be good. All right. Well, I guess we're done. All we got to do now is test it out. And um, like I said, it's quick install, maybe 10 minutes total. And that's even with trying to film it and everything else. So um, actually doing it yourself, or if you got a buddy helping you, maybe even quicker than that. But the only thing we got left to do with this unit is just test it out, make sure everything runs correctly. And um, my batteries right now have about three quarter power on them. So it is gonna run and kick up. And, um, and that's one thing, whenever you get off the water, although it may say that you have full power, it's always a good thing because this, this unit is also a trickle charge unit just like having an onboard charger. So whenever you get home, just plug it into the, to your wall socket in the garage or in the house. And um, that's all you need. Never another need for another battery charger. So let's um, go ahead and hook her up and make sure everything runs correctly. You hear it come on? All right, well that was our install for today. Hopefully this information will help you. And if you'd like more information on PowerMax converters, visit our website, www.powermaxconverters.com or you can contact Aaron Trimble. His information is listed below. And um, I'll tell you what guys, I strongly suggest PowerMax converters. Not because, you know, one, that they that they work with us and, and we've used their product for over a year now, but it's honest to God, good product that'll keep you on the water all night and get you through that all night fishing on tournaments, guiding, whatever it may be, or just recreation, boat fishing itself. So check them out, PowerMax converters. You can't get any better.